Let's talk about Neuralink for a second. So what's the concept of Neuralink? The, yes. the concept of Neuralink is that I'm gonna take whatever knowledge is encoded in my brain, directly transfer it into your brain. So this is a beautiful, fascinating, and extremely sort of, you know, appealing concept, but I see a lot of challenges surrounding that. Mm -hmm. The first one is we have no idea how to even begin to understand how knowledge is encoded in a person's brain. I mean, I told you about this paper that we had recently with Li Hui Tsai and uh, Asaf Marco, that basically was looking at these engrams that are formed with combinations of neurons that co-fire when a stimulus happens, mm -hmm. where we can go into a mouse and select those neurons that fire by marking them, and then see what happens when they first fire, and then select the neurons that fire again when the experience is repeated. These are the recall neurons. And then there's the, the memory consolidation neurons. So we're starting to understand a little bit of sort of the distributed nature of knowledge encoding and experience encoding in the human brain and in the mouse brain. And the concept that we'll understand that sufficiently one day to be able to take a snapshot of what does that scene from Dave losing his mind, of, of, of Hal losing his mind and talking to Dave, um, how is that scene encoded in your mind? Imagine the complexity of that. But now imagine, suppose that we solve this problem. And the next enormous challenge is how do I go and modify the next person's brain to now create the same exact neural connections? So that's an enormous challenge right there. So basically it's not just reading, it's now writing. And again, what if something goes wrong? I don't wanna even think about that. That's number two. And number three, who says that the way that you encode, Dave, I'm losing my mind, and I encode, Dave, I'm losing my mind, is anywhere near each other. Mm. Basically, maybe the way that I'm encoding it is twisted with my childhood memories of running through you know, the pebbles in Greece, mm -hmm. and yours is twisted with your childhood memories in of Russia. growing up yeah. in Russia. And there's no way that I can take my encoding and put it into your brain, because it'll A, mess things up, and B, be incompatible with your own unique experiences. So that's telepathic communication from human to human. It's fascinating.